Hi, Firestarter here, and welcome to my review of the Action Works Sha Sha Shider. So I finally found him um, on uh, when I went back, like I mentioned before, when I went to the Philippines to find one of these. I saw one um, one set before uh, three of them, Shaban, uh, Gavin, and Shider all together. I ignored um, these toys, and I re uh, now I'm regretting. So uh, also a big shout out to Darth, Darth Zara because of his review of the action works. Um, I just found out they're awesome. And big shout out too to Demon who uh, showed me where to find these guys. So and also a uh, big shout out to um, Agent of Anar Anarchy. Uh, he wanted to he wanted me to review this figure altogether. So also a friend of mine in H HWM Singapore, uh, Johnson Lim, big, big shout out to you too. Uh, they just want, this one is for you. Um, we have here the Action Works uh, Shider. He is the third Uchu KG or uh, Space Sheriff. And we got this a uh, nice cool blue box Action Works um, Uchu KG Shider. Uh, Mega House, Made in China, um, Uchu KG, Shider, some of the cool uh, poses, um, Shider, Shider Action Works, Best Action and Best Proportion, ah, who wants to compete with SA Trigger Arts, uh, anyway, let's open this baby, and let's see what it looks like underneath the hood. So, um, I'll pause for a minute and then we'll be back with all the accessories. So, these are all the accessories for Shider. We got the extra head, which has a light advisor. Um, it has like a, a nice detail, but uh, the one thing I would complain about is the helmet because, uh, as you can see, there is a mark where the two halves uh, meet. So it's not a seamless uh, helmet altogether, and um, but I do like the detail on the helmet. Um, it has a lot, lot of paint, uh, nice paint apps um, for a small figure. Oh, you got the parts for the ears, the um, visor over here, some of the um, dotted lines or at least uh, mechanisms or what have you on the forehead. So as the back and um, somewhat an aerodynamic feature on the helmet because like there's holes at the back for him to breathe because it can be like uh, suffocating inside the helmet without like unlike Kamen Riders we got some holes on the front of the face or in front of the face at the face so they can breathe but um, I think they have the holes at the back so the air could uh, circulate on the helmet. We got two kinds of swords. Just the laser, uh, the, so the um, sword for uh, the um, common battles with other um, Kuma hatchlings. And uh, he uses this uh, so often. And we got the laser sword. When uh, you know that this is the end of the battle when this sword turns to blue, you know something's going on. Um, this is a translucent plas blue plastic. It's not that re that not that bendable, but it's noticeable that um, it's a soft plastic. And there are cool details on the handle. We got the laser magnum. It's painted in matte silver, and the rest is just uh, plain molded, molded in black. And look at the details on the laser magnum, laser magnum. That's cool. They even managed to put a hole in here. Um, holster for the laser magnum. There's a hole over here, so you can peg that at the uh, at the hips of Shider. Um, although I'll show you later that there's a little uh, nuisance in terms of having the uh, gun inside the holster. 
And we got five giants of hands. We got two hands. Um, this one is for holding the laser magnum. And this one too. We got um, some cool uh, dramatic hand poses. And this one is for holding the sword. And this one also is for the laser magnum. Holding the laser magnum. Um, the cool detail would be the uh, details on the gloves and it's painted in shiny silver I wouldn't say um, matte or it's between matte and um, metallic finish so these are all the accessories for Shider let's move on to the figure Uchu Keiji Shider yeah Okay, um, articulation points for Shider in uh, Action Works. We got the flipping shoulder pads. If you're familiar with SH Figure Arts, it's very common. But um, it's I think it's the first time I've seen in another toy line to have this kind of hinge for the shoulder pads. Um, head articulation, it looked um, just like any other SH Figure Arts, I guess. It looks like it's uh, loose, but it's actually not. It's um, it's firm and planted well on the head uh, you can tilt that in many ways you can rotate the head freely there's a neck joint also for um, added possibility you got a sh uh, torso articulation waist too um, there is a hinge as you can see here and when you bend shider towards you you can see that bends too that is the pivot point for ab crunch single jointed elbow um, swiveling arm so as the hand because it is on a peg and a hinge on the hand so you can swivel that in or out and then we got the hip joints the hip joints is uh, very similar with um, SIC Kiwami Tamashi you got uh, not really uh, much on um, the reach for the hip joints it's not as uh, flexible as uh, SIC's but it's uh, fair nonetheless it's a nice addition to the figure being being this one has been released five years ago it's really nice civil on the uh, um, hip and double jointed knee and oops it happens a lot it pegs out it pops out if you um make him pose in a uh, in an awkward manner we got the hinge on the heel um swiveling leg and um this one swivels also from left to right now um the real cool detail about this is just the accuracy of the figure to the um, Space Sheriff like the um, details and um, additional paint apps on this. Um, the blue color on him is a matte, a matte blue but it somehow shines through my really bright light so as the silver paint on it it's also matte silver but the additional detail is the additional colors on the hips the chest and the visor so how big is he actually he's quite the size of like for example as i see kiwami tamishi agito like what i have here hello oops hi so possibilities all you gotta do is just put the holster on the side of Shider and picks well. And we got the Shider um, Magnum or Laser Magnum. Um, the problem I can see here is that uh, although it fits on the holster, um, when you tilt Shider up, it falls down. It's not like other toys, but. Um, it's a good addition nonetheless we got here and then we can um, replace that with a holding hand just for holding the sword 
Yeah, he, get, he has a lot of possibilities as I can see for a toy that was made five years, six years ago. Um, he is a really cool figure. Uh, the problem is that nowadays he, he is also a rare toy to find. So if you have a chance to find one um, in a reasonable price, like I always say, get one. Because this one is really a fun toy to have, especially if you've watched um, Shider. So there you have it. Action Works Shider. So if you want to know the possibilities for this figure, do check out the photos at the end of the video and do subscribe to my blogspot for my full return view. This is Firestarter. Thank you very much. And until the next review. Shider Super Slash! Wait, action pose, action pose, action pose! Okay, bye!